Hey there! In this video tutorial, we're going to show you how to get started with the Echo app. You'll need to use the app to finish setting up your Core 500. The app is required to take recordings with the Core 500 and view AI results on the device's screen. You'll also need it to visualize the three lead ECG. We'll show you how to create an Echo account and connect the Core 500 with the app. We'll also give you a tour of the main features. Let's get started. First, let's download the app. You can get the app on iOS and Android devices. Download it for free in the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. Next, create an Echo account in the app. At the bottom of the screen, tap Create Account. Enter your information. Look for a confirmation email in your inbox. You'll need to confirm your account. Follow the on-screen instructions for connecting the Core 500. You'll need to connect your Core 500 to the app using Bluetooth pairing. Now, let's take a tour of the Echo app. On the Listen screen, you can start listening to body sounds right after you open the app. This also lets you instantly visualize PCG and ECG. At the bottom of the screen is the heart rate in beats per minute. If the rate can't be detected, two dashes appear instead. You can start a single recording for a range of body sounds or take a guided four-point cardiac exam. Tap the headphones icon to start wireless listening. In audio settings, turn on wireless listening. This lets you play sound from headphones or hearing aids. Tap the audio filter icon to change the filter. You can choose between cardiac, pulmonary, and wide. Wide is for all use cases. We recommend using the wide filter first because it has the widest bandwidth for all body sounds. Then, the cardiac and pulmonary filters can be selected to focus on specific sounds for those use cases. On the menu screen, change your app, account, and device settings. Recording analysis uses AI to check for signs of heart disease for every recording. This is on by default. Record automatically means the recording starts automatically when the Core 500 detects a good signal. In the Core 500 settings, you can change the settings for your device. You can turn on or off the touch sensor and active noise cancellation. You can also choose if the ECG waveform displays on the device. See the Echo Help Center for more details. On the Patient screen, you can manage your patients and playback recordings. You can navigate between assigned and unassigned recordings. Great, now let's take a recording. Place the device on the patient. Recording begins automatically if the Record Automatically setting is on. Keep the device still for best analysis and audio quality. You can see the recording and analysis results on the summary screen. Here, you can also export or print the recording by tapping the Share button. You can export the recording with text message, email, or any other options on your mobile device. Here's a tip. You can also start a recording from the Core 500 and keep your mobile device in your pocket. The device must be actively connected to the Echo app. Press the top button for two seconds to start a recording. The bars around the screen light up green when recording is in progress. You can review and assign the recording to a patient in the Echo app. That's it. Now that you've learned the basics for the Echo app, you're ready to go. You can learn more in our Help Center at support.echohealth.com. Thanks for watching.